Hello and welcome back to the Squad the Builder channel and to some more Stardew Valley. Um, today we're going to visit the wizard. Um, I think his name is like Res Resmodius. Oh, wizard. Yeah. Ah, come in. Well, I hope your day is going good today. And, uh, oh, Resmodius. I am Resmodius, seeker of the arcane truths. Meteor between the physical and eth ethereal? Hmm. Okay. Master of the seven elementals. Keeper of the sacred chow. You get the point. Okay. Keeper of the sacred chalists of... And you, Jeb Jebsonson. The one whose arrival I've long, long foreseen. Have you now? Hmm. Okay, well, I wonder what's got cooking over there. That, uh, some, something's boiling. Maybe burning. Uh, here, I'd like to show you something. Okay. Behold. Oh, it's the, it's the little, uh, ap apple rat monster thing. Hello. Huh. You've seen one before, haven't you? Yeah, at the, uh... At the, uh, community center. They call themselves the Ju Juminos, Junimos, Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's because you look a little bit, like, uh, suspicious or something. I don't know. I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I saw that thing. The, uh... Oh, golden scroll. Hmm, you found a golden scroll written in an unknown language. Most interesting. I thought so. Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. Like, you're going all the way to the community center? Okay. I wish I could do that. I mean... I'm just kidding. It's actually... It's, it's not really that far. Oh, he's back. I found the note. Okay. The scroll. Oh, the scroll. Okay, yeah. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. Don't tell me it was like a shopping list. We are the Junime. Junime. Um, we, the Junime, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you'll see the true nature of this scroll. Well... I'm almost one with the forest. Hmm. One with the forest. What do they mean? I don't know. Like... Like... I don't know. <laughs> sniff, sniff. Why are you smelling it? Or are you smelling that weird thing you're burning? Aha. What's going on here? Come here. I don't know. Like, I'm really starting to get a bad feeling about this. I think this guy's trying to... Get, get me uh, on crack or something. <laughs> um, baby fern, moss grub, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? I don't want to smell it. No. I'm completely okay. Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. <clears throat> yeah, at this point, I probably would be backing towards the door. Not drinking it. Okay. Well, what could go wrong, right? What's the worst that could happen? Oh, wait a minute. Uh-oh. Why am I hallucinating a tree? I mean, I'm not surprised. Because I just drank some weird stuff. Um. Am I going to wake up in the forest missing, like, my clothes and stuff or something? Like, what's going on here? Uh, lesson lesson learned, kids. Don't drink weird stuff from a weird guy who lives in a... I've gained the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junime scrolls. Okay, yeah, don't drink strange potions from creepy old people that claim to be wizards um, in the forest. Like I just did. Don't do that. It takes years of study to understand the language of the elements. 
To actually speak their language requires a lifetime of devoted effort. Now if you'll excuse me. So you drug me. And then I didn't walk outside. Like, so you drug, drugged me. Then drugged me outside. And left me out there. You weren't even watching. I could have been mauled by like bears or something. Yeah. So yeah, don't get in that situation. Raising. I really want to build the chicken coop. And I thought that I've met. Like that didn't count. But I guess I wouldn't tell anybody if I met a creepy old guy who drugged me and then drugged me in the woods. Should go fishing to get rid of those memories. Anyway. So, uh, I'll probably just start the video here. Hi, welcome back to the Squad the Builder channel. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, my inventory's full. What do I got? Oh, I got... Hmm. I'll probably throw that away. I, I'm sure I shouldn't be throwing away that uh, fiber, but... At this point... I mean, I have enough money. I gotta go get the backpack. I completely forgot about that. Hello. I don't want to read the sign. Oh, it's Penny. We don't have a school here, but I'm doing my best to give Vincent and Yas, Joss, a proper education. Good. That's pretty cool. Can somebody please tell me how to say that name? Because I don't know. Is it is it like Joss or... Every child deserves a chance to be successful. Well, tell that to that wizard. Uh, Joss is very good at math and reading. Vincent is good at, well... He has an active imagination. That's not a bad thing. Yeah, math people need people with good imaginations to imagine the stuff math people can imagine. Or even vice versa. So. Yeah. Cool. Backpack. Gotta stay focused. Keep, <laughs> keep forgetting about the backpack. And the sewer. Eventually I would like to explore the sewer, but I feel like I'm not ready for that. I don't know if you can get weapons or anything in this. Something tells me I might need a weapon before um, going into the sewer, maybe. Oh, everything's grown really good. I forgot what I planted down there. Hmm. Let me put everything in there. All my flowers. I'm sure I'll need them for something. I probably shouldn't be selling those either, but... Oh, I didn't even think about it. I have the chests. Hey, doggo. Doggo. Hey, doggo. Doggo, I'm going to move your bed. Is this his bed? There. What is that? I don't know, a light? Oh, it's a light. Okay. Oh. Okay. Thanks, Doggo. Um, he's a really heavy sleeper. But anyway, I could have saved that food. Next time I'm I'm uh, gonna put it in my chest. That was day ten of spring, year one. Oh, sweet. I actually made some good money from the uh, fruit the fruit or vegetables, whichever that was. Good morning, chicken. I haven't seen a chicken, like, anywhere, so where is that chicken noise coming from? Do I have, like, a chicken locked in the basement? Uh, hi there. Good morning. Oh, hey, Clint. I noticed that you have been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. Okay. If you want to get the most out of the ores you find, you'll need a furnace. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Just so happens I have an extra set of blueprints uh, lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Well, thank you. I actually appreciate that. Uh, let me see. I learned how to craft the, the furnace. Cool. Thank you, Clint. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. Okay. Can I make a sword? Clint? Um, okay. <laughs> when you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. 
They can make your work a lot easier. Well, that sounds good. Well, okay, I'm headed home. Take it easy. You too. Thanks for stopping by. And just like that, he was gone. Um, oh, these are... Oh, I have to have the scythe. What are these again? I cannot remember what I planted. Oh, kale. I think kale is like... Seaweed, maybe? Or something? I basically don't know anything about farming, but then again, this is only like... Uh, my 10th day or something as a farmer, so yeah. I'm gonna have to get some more seeds too. I am running out of steeps. Running out of uh, crops. That's what it is. I lost my favorite axe. Uh, if you can find it, please return ASAP. I'm having a tough time without it. There's 250 gold in it for whoever finds the thing. Robin. Okay, cool. I, I said 250 gold. I have no idea if the G stands for gold, so if it if it doesn't, feel free to let me know. Um, I'm going to take these, take what I can carry, and go sell in town because I have enough for the backpack now. So I'm pretty, pretty excited about that, and I think it's springtime because I see, like, flowers or petals or leaves or something falling, which is... It's really pretty. I'm, I'm enjoying the art style of this game. I think it's really cool. There's so much more. Oh, that's right. They don't open yet. And I missed the mayor's birthday and some little kid's birthday. So, that happened. This game has so much more to it than I thought it did. I'm, I'm surprised. Ple uh, pleasantly surprised. You, you're like... Now I keep forgetting, but is, this isn't the place that I worked at, is it? This is just like a convenience store. I haven't stopped in yet. I keep trying to uh, stay focused because I keep forget, forgetting what I was doing. <coughs> Heck him up. But uh, hopefully Clint's in. Oh no, they open at 9 too. Okay. Dang. Is the, lib is the museum open? I'll check the trash. What is that? Um, I can eat that. Oh, that's right. It's kale. All right. Well, hold on. Let me, let me give this guy the spur. Where is he? Oh, he's up there. I forgot. Yes. That's what, okay. Some stuff is trash. Some stuff they want. So I wasn't sure if he'd want the, <laughs> want the spur. Okay. He doesn't have anything else for me. Um, oh wait, yeah, what is this? It is an eel. Why did that guy have an eel in his, Never mind. in the trash, yeah. Um, yep. How much is it? Oh no, I need the backpack. Yeah, I need the backpack. At least I think I do. I would like to get the backpack first. I'm gonna get the backpack before I get any upgrades, so. I don't know which one's actually probably more important, but I'd imagine the backpack. That way I can actually uh, carry some. I keep going in the graveyard. Whoops. Hey, who are you? Oh, it's Penny. Uh, we're very lucky to have a library in such a small town. I would agree, I suppose. Um, you're the last in a, oh, when you're the last, when you're lost in a book, English hard, it's easy to forget the realities of your life. Maybe that's why I like reading so much. Why? What's wrong with your life, Penny? Sorry, I got carried away there. Well, it sounds like you got some stuff going on. Um, I have just the thing for you. There. Thank you. This looks special. It is. I think. Do you want an eel? No. Okay. Maybe I should have started with the eel? I don't know. I was just trying to cheer her up. Seemed like she's having a bad day, so. Nothing posted today. Let's go get our backpack. Um, here, yeah, buy the stuff. 3,500. Wow. Oh wait, no, no, 
Is there a way to return stuff? I didn't mean to click that. I was trying to click the X. Um, Pierre, I didn't want to buy the sugar. Pierre. Pierre, can you take the sugar back? Uh, okay. Oh, you're on a hard bargain. Apparently, no returns. And I got the backpack. So happy. You got the large backpack. Yes, I do. Wait, there's another one? Already? 10,000? 10,000, Pierre. You're a monster. Wow. You're a not... You're a terrible human being. Uh, Alright. Well, I gotta buy some more seeds anyway, because I'm pretty much out, so... Might as well buy some seeds. Um, we'll go with potatoes. I don't really know which one's the best, so if, if anybody happens to know what seeds are better than other seeds, uh, again, please let me know. <laughs> wow, that only gave me one more bar. I mean, I guess it's something. Abigail. Uh, oh no, I think my dad's going, what? I accidentally hit the button. Here, have an eel. That'll make you feel better. Uh, what am I supposed to do with this? Um, eat it. Or go put it back in the ocean. I don't know. I didn't think that far ahead. Okay, well. Honestly, I was just trying to get rid of the eel. I didn't know what to do with it, so. I'll go and uh, plant, plant some of my potatoes and uh, try and do a little bit of work on the farm. Let's see. Oh, no, nope, that one's still good. Yeah. There you go. Just trying to get everything squared up here. I have 27. Yep, 27 seeds. Cool. Probably only cost me like a $1,000. That merchant guy. I mean, I don't know. I guess I'm not from the... Uh, land of Stardew Valley, so maybe 10,000 G's gold, 10,000 whatever for a backpack, I mean is that all my potato seeds? Well, it really seemed like that went quick anyway, anyway I'm not gonna let that bother me, you know, here in the country th things are a bit different, so I'm just gonna roll with it And besides, it's not like I didn't get paid like 250 for a fish or a flower. I can't remember what it was, so. And to, uh, yeah, get them. Try and keep, I try and keep the, uh, watering can full. What is this? Oh, it's the sugar. Okay. Well, that does pretty good. 25, 25 energy, 11 health, I think it was. Craft the furnace. What do I need to do that? Oh, I need copper ore and stone. Do I have any copper ore? Oh, no, I just sold my copper ore. No, is it this one? I have one stone. Oh, but I do have fertilizer. Is it too late to use the fertilizer? I wonder. Let me try. Oh, well, it says I can put it down. Okay. Huh. I better start getting some stones then. So I think I need like 20 copper and a bunch of stone. So I'm going to start uh, forging and uh, collecting some items so I can build the furnace. Oh, there's your doggo. Where is he? I don't see him. I wonder if he just, I wonder if he roams around. I tried to get him to follow me, but I couldn't, so. I wonder if he just like roams around and stuff, or. Oh, I got a geode, sweet. I'll have to take that to Clint. Um, I got two of them. Yeah, I don't know. I'll have to figure it out what, as far as what Doggo, 
doggo can do. Um, I'll throw those up there in the storage. And I'm going to uh, end this one here. And uh, so I hope you enjoyed the video. And thank you for joining me. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.